Hey YouTube, so this is my first backgammon video. I've noticed, uh, you know, not a lot of backgammon like live streaming or YouTube commentary videos, uh, other than some ones with like Falafel, the world's number one player, which are very good and very helpful. Uh, I want to just, before we get going, say I am by no means an expert player. Uh, I just really like to play and I, I'm pretty, I'm okay. Um, so I think we'll hopefully everyone will learn something as we, as we play these games. I'm about to do my first game. Uh, I'm using a free trial of this screencast software, so I only have 15 minutes. So it's just going to be a three-point match against one of my friends. Uh, and we'll, I'm going to pause this and we'll get going uh, when the game's ready to go. Okay, so here we go with the game. He rolls a nice opening, 6-5, one of the naturals. I'm playing the gray pieces, he's playing the red pieces. I also roll a 6-5. Very easy. I think we're both playing perfect so far. Double fives. I suspect he just uh, makes his three point from the midpoint. This the midpoint's right here. Plays two down. Doubles you play twice. Uh, normally you just move according to each number, but if it's doubles you play them both twice. Six four. I suppose I just run right. I have to. Uh, I hope he doesn't roll a deuce, and then I have him with one man back. Race is about even. You can see the pip count right down here. One forty six to one thirty six. Double fours for him. He's got speed. If this is going to be a race, he's actually up. He's going to be up quite a bit in the race, but he still has that man back that could be some danger for him. Four four is obviously good for us because it doesn't hit. And by the way, if there's a yellow halo around my mouse, I hope I remember to turn that function off um, in post-production. I think 6-5 just played a safety. No point hitting or doing anything else, leaving him a shot. Uh, if I know Ian, he just runs. And running is probably correct. Although, it, I mean, I do have a lot of awkward rolls coming up that would leave him shots, so I don't know if running's correct. It might be down from the midpoint. Oh, interesting. Running slot. Um, I'm not... Oh, man, I'm down so much in the race. But it's such disaster. This is such a tester. Uh, and he's going to cube me. God, I just feel so gross about it. I think I have to hit just because I'm down so much. Oh, brutal. And he hits back. Oh, that's so gross. Alright, good shot by him. I suspect a cube is coming. I still have outs to hit a 4, send him back. Hopefully like 4-1 or 6-4 are or my dream rolls. So I got a guy now that's going to come up on the bar. Unless he doesn't hit, but that would be pretty crazy. I mean, he's, got, he's, he's it's a forced hit if he's running, so... Wouldn't hate it if he would make this decision a little faster, just so, just because of the 15 minutes. Got to come in on the deuce since the three is covered. Play three down, try to make that. I suspect a cube is coming, and I will not take it. He does not cube. Interesting. Maybe it's too good. Honestly, his, his position's probably too good to, to cue, actually, now that I think about it. He's got a lot of gamma potential here. If he can just get me on the roof, it could be good night nurse. And he can really comfortably slot and try to pick up those two blots I have on my side of the board in the event that I hit. So he's going to cover this one, obviously. I just... Oh, okay. I probably... Eh. Wow. Okay, so this is an important roll. I don't want to run because I'm down so much in the race. Plus, I can't run anyway because that would be to here. I also don't want to get gammoned. So I think this is the six, right? And this is the five. And hope for another chance to get a shot. He might hit. Slot the six point prime. He does not hit. Interesting. God, tempting me to run, but I don't fall for such temptations. Run to safety. Don't get gammoned. Ugh, I, how do I win this game? I don't think I do, so I'm going to run and hope he lets me out for one. He should definitely be cubing. I don't know what he's doing. He's up by 30 pips. It's a must pass. I might have played that 6, because the, the way I played that 6-4 is basically resigning, but I didn't feel I had much better... I'm just trying to fill out my board in the event that I'm allowed to bear off. But I'm thinking soon he's going to realize he should be cubing.
I don't know what is going on. We have a race, and I'm not winning this race. Now I'm just trying to get my guys in. I don't know why he's not cubing. I have no chance of winning this race. So for the sake of the video, I'm going to tell him to just cube me and end it. There we go, 5-1, five, 5 down. I guess I, 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 I've, I've, I've started slotting this, slotting my, my 5 point. Like just cause, purely because I heard Falafel plays 5-1 that way. So I switched it up, and that's part of my style now. Alright, but that's that's straightforward. Um, now I'm not slotting it, because he's got two to kill, so we're just going to mirror his play. Oh, 5-4, what to do? Wouldn't shock me if he ran. Wouldn't shock me if he played uh, 23, 18, 24, 20. That meaning this to here, and then this back one to here in hopes that I only hit one and then maybe he can make a point. Or I hit none and he can make a good point. But he does opt to just run. 5-1's not a killer. I think I'm going to slot that. And... Ugh, do I want to do that? I think I do. And just play that like a bitch. I don't know. 6-4 is a double kill potentially. Or he can make this point. So I... He does... Oh, or he just single kills. Okay. 4 and now I'm going to kill him. Deuce, he's got a six. I suspect he kills, so we're looking for a three. A lot of not deuce three or six three, but any other three is good. Ooh, he doesn't kill. Okay, let's look at this. Race is about even. Let's roll. Hmm. Ideas. Double kills is in play. Although watching some world class players recently, I've learned that this kind of double kills to leave a blot on the deuce or the ace is not always best. That being said, I don't see what's better. So we're going to go for it and hope he doesn't hit a deuce. He does not. He only hits a three. I don't think we can cube just yet, but we got a lot of good numbers. Double fives are one of them. Ah, we got the deuce. Let's make the four and come down to the bar. So we're up a little bit in the race. Uh, he, both of his runners are blocked by 4-4, four, four, so he's probably going to just make his 5-point, and he does. Ace-deuce from space. Ugh. I mean, kill and, play, kill and safety is such a nit move. Says that. I guess kill and safety, hope for fan, and then hope for 6-1. No fan. No such luck. We'll come in on the deuce, and then I'm probably play to here, and now I'm kind of, nah. Fortunately, I have this guy here that can is bearing on some points for me. I guess that's it. It's got to be. What else can it be? It's kind of a boring game. I hope I roll big doubles. That's useful. Make a very valuable point. I would really like to roll 6-6. Six, six. That would be in the cards. We're in the dice. We only have six more minutes. May have to stop this video quickly or hope to just play for it all soon. Cuban and Gammon in the next six minutes sounds like a plan to me. Deuce, deuce. I got the deuce, deuce. It's quack fucking city. Couple of ducks. 4-4 once again block. Too much speed, Ian. That's a lot of speed. Now I'm feeling good. Now I'm feeling like I can definitely cube him and he's going to be uncomfortable. And I think he's probably going to pass it. He's got to be nervous. He can't like the way this is starting to shape up. Yeah. I don't know if that's a cube and I don't know if it's a pass, but 3-1 natural opening. All right, the score is tied 1-1. Two more points. To win the match. Three one. Stop going into the tank. Alright. Six three. 
I think it's just run all the way. Awkward roll for him. He might just play to his five point from the midpoint. He does. 6 4. I mean, it's got to be this. What else could it be? Deuce 1 is a good shot for him. He makes his four point. Uh huh. Uh huh. This would make my four point. I kind of want to do that. I do kind of want to do that. Why do I want to do that? Ugh, I still have bad sixes. Why do I do this? I'll do that. This gives me flexibility. It might be wrong. I really don't know. Four minutes left on the video. This one might get cut short, kids. But if it does, just assume that I won. Okay. Um... Can I wait for a better time to run, considering I can also be making my three point? What's the race? The race, okay, if he doesn't roll a three, I can just cube. Okay, there we go. And now I'm gonna cube him. I think that's, there's a lot more value than I ever initially realized when I started playing. I do want a double, yes indeed. He might take. He might be a take, who knows? I sure don't. I hope he takes, so maybe we can finish this. Uh, he does not take. Alright, now we're at the Crawford game, so he cannot cube me here. we got three minutes to beat him. move for the 5-4. I think that's standard. I could double kill. Do I want to? What more could I do? What better could I do? Let's just go for it. Let's just go for it. I don't know. I hate my position already. I really do. He makes the golden point. That's a bailout. Let's just move those all the way up. Let's make his golden point. I just learned that term. We got two minutes left. This is not looking good unless we roll double sixes or double fives. That looks nice. I'm going to pause this video actually until we see how this plays out and then maybe we'll catch the ending. So, as you can see, it became a race. Uh, that I'm way ahead in. It's looking like I'm going to win. We'll see if we can bear off quickly. we got a minute and a half left. I'll pause it again just for safety. Okay, we're back. I'm sorry for unpausing then repausing. Uh, as you can see, he's going to need to roll double sixes a bunch of times. He's really backed up there and I got no misses. So, it's possible. We'll see. He is very fast, but who knows if he's this fast. There we go. That's game. And that's it. So thank you guys very much for watching. Hopefully there's more to come. Uh, I'm going to hopefully be playing some against one of my other buddies later tonight. So stay tuned for that. Thanks, guys.